Hi, this is Gail with Gail Southern Living. Today I'm doing my Survival Seeds 2024 update hosted by the Vineyard Chicks. And these are my red kidney beans. Looking pretty good. Getting pretty tall. I don't know if you could tell how tall they are from the video. But they're pretty tall and I have quite a few of them in here. There's kind of like a little hole in the middle. I think I planted some basil in the middle. Just maybe for a little layer of protection possibly. So these are my red kidney beans. Right here in this orange bucket, I have my wantham butternut squash. I have one of them. And this one seems to be doing pretty good. Uh, the butternut squash did not come up in this tire. I do still have two seeds left. I think I'm going to put one in each tire. So it's supposed to be that tire and this tire with seeds. So not a lot of luck on the butternut squash. Um, I did grow butternut squash in here last year that came up great. Uh, so far the bucket seems to be doing the best for some weird reason. Um, so I'll throw a couple more seeds in here and we'll keep going. My Walla Walla onion... There's a little bit in there, you can barely see it, but there's a little bit going on in this tire. Okay, this is the second tire, Wantham Butternut Squash. There's a little bit going on in here, but not too much. Okay, this is my pepper and sini peppers that I did the paper towel method. And then I put them under the grow lot in a little pot, and then I transplanted them outside. They seem to be doing okay. I thought two would be an okay amount in this tire here. So this is how they are doing. Okay, on the red Detroit beets. I have several growing here. I think there's about four. I did plant some more seeds. I purchased some myself uh, to, to plant in here. So I have four up right now. Now this one had about five in here, but I believe something got to them. You see the stem right there? Something ate on this. So I'm going to grab some diatomaceous earth and um, treat several of my plants uh, with that and see if that helps. Okay, on the Mariana tomatoes, I have one there, one there, so that's two. Uh, the one under here did not come up. There's three, and there happens to be two over there, so that's five. I might transplant that one over here, and I did plant some basil in here as a companion plant for the tomatoes. So that's how my survival seat update is for now, and this is my survival seed area. I do have some... Um, herbs and things growing in the middle, some chamomile, cilantro, a couple of flowers, and uh, over here I have my borage. So that's that's my uh, some of my herbs I have going. My oregano is growing super, super slow, but I do have a pot of that over there. So this is my update, update for Survival Seeds 2024, hosted by the Vineyard Chicks. Hope you guys enjoyed my update, and... Uh, Anyway, best wishes to all the survival seed growers this year. I hope they do really well for you, and I will keep going. As long as I have seed, I will keep planting. You guys have a great day. Be blessed. Do something kind, guys. Bye, everybody.